Apple pushed back down. I'm going to take a little, I'm going to take a little long position in Apple here and I'll scale into it. If it comes down to that pivot, 116 calls, 10 days to expiration. I'm doing the 116 calls in Apple. Uh, let's do uh, 10 contracts to start. 272 is the price. Got filled at 272. So looking for a little bounce in Apple, I'll scale into more size if it, if it pushes down to this pivot. Had the higher volume bar here a couple bars ago and then it pushed past that. So could be a decent entry. Uh, Amazon's got right, So Apple's starting to bounce a little bit. I'm gonna put in an order to close half my Apple. Uh, so I got in at 272. I'll put it in an order at 292 to close half my Apple. If it keeps bouncing. Filled an Apple for half my position. So I've still got half left. We are on our second green bar here. I'll, I'm gonna put in an order to scale out of a couple more of my Apple contracts. Put an order up at 295 if it makes a quick push. I'll be scaling out of the rest anyway at the, near the close of this bar. All right, filled in Apple. So I've still got a couple left in Apple. I've got three contracts left in Apple. All right, so Apple, I'm gonna put in a closing order for the remainder at 305. See if it makes one more nice push for me. All right, this bar is getting ready to close in Apple, so I'm gonna go ahead and close out the remaining amount. Drop my order to three bucks, see if it gets hit. Filled an Apple. All right, so I'm out of Apple, nice little winner there.